Welcome back to Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee. Today, we're gonna to be going for a test drive in a 1970 Buick Skylark convertible. This one here's got a 350 under the hood. Looks like it's got the AC compressor. We'll be testing it out. Power steering's on this one as well. Drum brakes all the way around. What we're gonna do is point out any kind of flaws running and driving wise. And then when we get back, we're gonna do a walk around, point out any kind of flaws inside out of this car. So be checking for two different videos. Should give you an overall 30 minute experience, letting you know everything about this car. We do that with every car up here. So check us out, maplemotors.com. You can see all of our inventory, get financing and shipping information. And if you hit that subscribe button, you can see cars going down the road every single day. So join us, it's that time. Let's go for a ride. All right, guys, gonna check this car out before we go down the road. Go ahead, place your bets. Do you think the horn works? Go ahead and start her up here. Starts up nice and easy. It's showing 53,000 miles. I'll get you close to the dash so you can see that. So we're just standing behind that. This is a 70 model. Go ahead and try the wipers. Boom, wipers work. Radio, sounds like it's working. Blower motor working AC I don't hear the compressor pulling on the motor so I'm gonna go ahead and say the AC is not working it is all hooked up in there um, probably just gonna need some work so we'll go ahead and cut all this off you ready for the horn horn works let's take off down the road okay guys I'm sweating bullets we're gonna take the top down now might as well you know got a convertible looking uh, like a chance of rain off in the distance too. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this done. Maybe we put the top up halfway through the test drive. All right, I've got it unclipped from both sides. Let's look around here. I know there's a switch. I'm trying to find this issue. Lighter, lights, washer, accessories. There we go. Top goes down. That already feels a million times better. We do got power windows in this thing. So we're gonna use the power windows. And they're working pretty good, look at that. Already got the driver window down. Passenger window is a little slow. All right, top's down, let's roll. Going ahead and get my seatbelt on. Let's take off down the road, get some wind blowing through the air. Or some sweat blowing through the air. <laughs> Anything that I see that this car may need, I will let you know. That's why I do these videos. Our speedometer is coming up. Uh, engine temperature is already warm on this one. So we're gonna go ahead and check for the kick down. Kickdown's hooked up. They have been hooked up on most of the cars here lately too, so. Uh, we're going straight as an arrow. The steering's nice and tight. I have got to walk, put this thing under this mat. It is blowing all over the place. All right. Gas gauge is moving around. Speedometer seems true. Motor feels pretty strong. Let's try the brakes. Brakes are nice on this one. Giving her a good amount of throttle and hitting the brakes hard, just testing everything out. This is a good running and driving car here tight steering straight down the road and it looks like most all of our gauges are working all of the accessories inside the car are working as well Get some outside videos. 
definitely look below in the description. You can see all of the gear that I use and Amazon links to buy them if you're interested in that. Good deal. Let's get these shots. This car's pretty quiet. Oh yeah. Pretty sweet looking ride here. Go ahead, and get y'all set up. Make sure you ain't looking at the floorboard the whole time. What about that? Does that look good, guys? Hey, comment below. Let me know. Do you like the head cam or the window cam more? Because I've been doing a little bit of both this week, just trying things out. Maybe just I'll just continue doing both. Just mixing it up, mixing it up. So far, so good on this engine temp, staying cool not noticed any overheating or issues we've been rolling around the parking lot a lot uh-oh i forgot to put the tag back on oh no well, the 508 ain't behind me yet, so let's just keep going. I'll just hold it up in the air. <laughs> no, I don't, I don't think they'd like that too much. We're getting too busy here. So far, so good. This car's running and driving good. We're gonna get on it a little bit through here. It's no race car. Just showing you it has good power. This car is made for cruising with the top down. Coming up on the road with a speed bump in it. Speed bump be kind of useless in this car because everything's nice and smooth. And there's not really any rattles. But we'll be listening for them anyways. Let's put her down in low. Bob's right. It's right there. Yeah, it's nice and smooth in this one. So, looks like we beat that rain. I know it's coming. It's all over there. All right, I'm gonna pull up over here. We're gonna do an outside walk around on this video. Point out any kind of flaws. That way you know what you're buying when you get here. I'm trying not to miss anything. So, let's pull in the lot here and. Get this walk around done. We'll just park it right here and get her done. All right, guys, I appreciate you watching this video. If you have any other questions, check out maplemotors.com for financing and shipping information. If you don't mind, hit that subscribe button. I do post vehicles every single day. If you like the music at the beginning of this video, that's uh, my personal band. Check us out, Southgate Production. We have our own YouTube channel on here and 
once I get enough subscribers, I'll start posting every night new songs that I write. I know that's different from this page, but might as well tell you about it. It's on here. I appreciate y'all watching. Thanks again.